I'm working from home, but I'm back. I'm Josh Rom, and this is Awards Watch. It may be the BAFTA TV Awards, but the great and the good of film are actually all nominated, with the likes of Killian Murphy, Taron Egerton, and Gary Oldman all securing awards. And that's just for actors. In the acting races, it's just as competitive with the likes of Kate Winslet, Billy Piper, Sarah Lancashire and Vicky McClure battling it out against the likes of Imelda Staunton for her performance as Queen Elizabeth II in The Crown. And speaking of The Crown, well, the tide at these awards might be turning in the favour of streaming, with more nominations than ever. Apple TV Plus picks up six nods, whilst Netflix received eight nominations for its content. However, there's still very much an audience for linear TV, and this set of nominations proves just that. The Traitors picked up some huge nominations. They're going to battle it out against the likes of RuPaul's Drag Race UK in the reality and constructed factual category. Meanwhile, Claudia Winkleman will battle it out against the likes of Lee Mack and Mo Gilligan for entertainment performance. And other huge TV shows pick up nominations too. Anton Deck Saturday Night Takeaway gets its 22nd nomination, whilst The Graham Norton Show gets its 13th nomination, both including the TV Craft Awards as well. And they're nominated alongside Strictly, which goes up against The Masked Singer for Entertainment Programme. Snub time now, and there was no nomination for Corey in the soap category. Those nominations went to Casualty, EastEnders, and Emmerdale. Elsewhere, I'm a Celebrity didn't get nominated for Entertainment or Reality Programme, and, well, the only ITV daytime show to be nominated for daytime is The Chase. Now, that's it for now, but don't forget to keep up to date for the latest news, reaction, and gossip on the Sunshaper's YouTube channel, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. See you next time.